Hello and welcome to Animax Plays Amnesia. This is uh, episode 4, I think. This sound should be better. It's quite loud, as you can probably tell. So we're just gonna jump straight back into this. Hopefully I won't die. Oh, I hate this game so much. <laughs> oh man. Okay, it's not responding. Congratulations. Um, well, okay, here I am. Here I am. Sam I am. Okay, today, let's go to... Hmm, where were we? Let's see what we got here. Archives? No! <laughs> No, that's not happening. Not yet, anyway. Looks like we're gonna need something to break these down. It won't budge. Ooh. Okie dokie. Yeah, so I was wondering if you guys wanted me to do a custom story. Because they're usually better and less sc scary to me with me. But they're better to watch because they're more fun. Well, just tell me what you what you want to watch, and I'll I'll play that instead. Let's go down here. I think last time I checked the cellar of wine, it's gonna the, the did we go to the laboratorium? I can't remember. Um, let's go to the laboratory. I hope we didn't go to last time. <laughs> yeah, we went to this last time. Let's go to the wine cellar this time. Yay! Just gonna love this. Fucking hate this game. Oh, man. Oh, good. I need a key. Great. Great news. Looks like there's only one place left to go. Uh, I really don't want to do this. I remember the archives in any game are always the worst. If I scream, do not laugh at me. Because I'm scared right now. Literally. Oh, come on, stop not responding. Great, more insects. Ooh, letter. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan. The mother of us nice all. Name. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Great. What is that noise anyway? Ah oh man, come on open. It doesn't look like an apple. It 
doesn't look like an eye from that. Can I? Yes, I can. Got it. I'm so scared right now. Where did I get a chemistry pot from? What the fuck? Excuse me, how insane am I? Slut, a headache. Okay, that's great. Oh, come on, what's that noise? It was you, wasn't it? You damn dirty chair. Die. Ooh, nifty. There we go. Yeah, nothing. Okay, thank you. Middle one. Yeah. Okay, nothing. Oh, goody books. Gotta love them useless fucking books. Ooh. What is that shit in here? Okay, did anyone else hear that? I really don't like that noise. I know this is where you encounter the first monster, I think. is like pumping right now. Oh god. Oh shit. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Let's find this fucking key and get out of here. Fucking ape shit, fucking ape shit, fucking ape shit. Uh, no! 
17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Okay. I'm so freaking scared right now. It's just the music, the music gets to you. How does it has a certain feel to it? How am I meant to get out? Okay, notes. Diary, mementos. Must find a new way out of this area. Okay. Um. Tell me the secret, boy. Tell me the secret. No, I'm just a nice little squirrel. No, you're not a squirrel. Tell me the secret, squirrel. Okay, I'm bringing you with me. Can I move this around? Nope, I can't. Great. Okay, there must be like a secret exit out of here somewhere. Where are you going? Come back here. At least I'm kind of safe in here. I got an idea. Maybe one of these books control something. Hmm. Tell me the truth. Hmm. There must be something here. Anyway, um, ooh, fragile but not breakable by hand. See, let's look for a hammer. Then we'll end the episode up there. Ooh, no, I can't play it. Okay. Chair, you shall help me in my expeditions. Let's do this, chair. I believe in you. Yeah. Okay, that didn't. That didn't work. Okay, chair. Go! Oh my god, I didn't know that would actually work. Anyway, thanks for watching. This has been Animax117, and I'll see you next time.